I'm in that trap, nigga. I be smoking shh, can't say it, nigga. I'm in that trap, nigga. I keep a gun up on my lap, you getting clapped, nigga. Nigga, I'm gonna walk down on this block, he getting smacked, nigga. Nigga kept on this. It's your boy Hollow, and I'm back with another bang. <laughs> Then y'all just gonna be chilling with me. I'm gonna take y'all and we gonna spend a day together so y'all can see some of the things that interest me and what I do in a day-to-day -day life. And today is gonna be a real educational video. Cause this one for the kids. I mean it's for everybody, but strictly kind of for the kids. But I want everybody to watch. Cause like I said, I'm every niche. That's how I feel. I wouldn't say I have a personality. I say I have a collection of songs I use with every and any situation to adjust them. That's just me. So let me see, consider that an identity crisis. Me? Mm, no. Fuck it. Me and Tut, though. I appreciate everybody that be tapping in and liking. I appreciate y'all. I see it. Come on. Make sure you keep, like, a good center and the bottom. Yeah. Like I said today, I lost my gold, so... I'm not really in a good mood to be cheerful. I'm still gonna do the video though. Starting the day off by brunch. Just moving. You know how to zoom in? Mm -hmm. Zoom in on that. Yeah. Now I'm here again. We here and it's black owned, you feel me? It's black owned. We getting our water bottles out of this. What the fuck is you talking about? Tap water is better. Tap water is way better. But it's the good. It's the good. It's the good. That's why I said it's the Martellini's glass. I don't even know. I'm feeling real. I'm feeling real rich right now. I'm feeling real. 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 I'm Life comes with ups and downs, you feel me? It's not what you can really do for me. But like I'm controlling the pace of why I'm pouring this apple juice because I'm real like that. You gotta look at your decisions like that too, you feel me? Now I'm gonna be elegant as hell, man. It's a straw. Spray that thing up, you feel me? Cause I don't drink liquor like that, but if I wanna pretend like this liquor, pretend like this liquor. Now, previously I said in the video back before, fans know if you to watch the video, that churches had the best honey butter biscuits, but I was wrong. Just spoons got the best honey butter biscuits. Astronomically, that shit don't get enough, you know what I'm saying? It's times like this where I realize you gotta be grateful for the little things, you know what I'm saying? Cause a lot of people can't come eat at no fine establishment like this. <laughs> so you gotta be appreciative of what you have right now. You can't get nothing bigger if you're not appreciating the little things right now. So this is the time frame of your life where you sit down and you appreciate every little thing that you got right now. So take a pause from this video and meditate. You feel me? Because shadow work is really important to bring your shadow self to your consciousness. A lot of y'all problems, y'all wouldn't realize that you actually have a problem because the shadow in you is pushing it down. So when you're doing shadow work, the goal is to bring your shadow self to consciousness. A lot of your bad habits come from the unconscious. So you're doing them without even realizing it. And that's not good. That's not good at all. So take a little time, meditate, and just think about anything that you are grateful for. Because you know, all the time we spend a lot of time complaining about stuff, and it just gets, it just clouds our, it just clouds our memory, you feel me? and that's not good, it's not good at all. So take some time, meditate, and come back. You know, by the time you meditate and come back, the food should be here. Uh, so them boys dress like they work at Publix. Oh, I can't even zoom in on them niggas, man. As promised, the food looking busting, bro. My eggs look moist, that's a good sign. That bacon crispy, that's another good sign. Look at that creamy grits, I like that, bro. I like that. I ain't never seen French toast that look like that, but it look good, so it don't matter. Catfish, 
Turkey bacon, that's real shit. If you eat turkey bacon, you're an animal. That shit don't even taste real, bro. Animal shit for real, bro. I hope y'all waking up and y'all eating something good too. You watching my video and you don't got nothing to eat? I'm sorry about that. I'm gonna enjoy my meal and then you're gonna catch me in my next daily activity. Alright. Follow me, stay with me. Hey y'all, my name's Gemini. We here with Hollow Life. <laughs> he was great. And it's me. You gonna subscribe? I'm gonna subscribe and I'm gonna tell people to subscribe too. Yes. So when you when you do your, your amazing pitch, because that's that was phenomenal. Yeah. You gotta let everybody else know. You gotta kind of sneak it in there some type of way without it being invasive. So like you just like hear somebody talk about content. Yeah. You know, you just just sneak in there and just you know, whisper in the ear. Sometimes you gotta be like your third party. Alright. Alright, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. And also if you're in Miami, Broward or whatever, or you're a tourist, make sure you visit just boom. And ask for Gemini support her. She's amazing. You gotta hear her pitch. I'm not gonna tell you her pitch. You gotta come to hear the pitch yourself. Definitely. Oh, hey there. I know a lot of you guys don't know how to shoot because you don't practice. So, for all the police officers that want to kill my people, huh? Or if you're a gang member and you like running down on ops. I'm gonna what did he say? Oh, I'm gonna show you how to properly aim so you're not hitting innocent people. Okay. Working with my baby, MMP Shield. More versatile than the Glock. Smaller, polymer grip. I like that. Got the ETS mag. I'm gonna be trying this mag out today to see if it really works. How compatible it is with my gun. All the way up. I shot the test fire to see where everything is lined up. Good job. Breathe in and out, V grip. We got the 22. Most people think they're not deadly, but it all depends on who's sending a round. Pretty sure nobody's ever got shot said, oh my God, it's just the 22. You know what you're doing. Now, I don't have my glasses, so we're not practicing for action right now. We're just shooting. Let's, let's, call, it, let's call it a stress sheet. So, lessons for you. Loaded this way, and I told you in the elbow pocket, right? Push in, make sure the mag is seated correctly. You can also look, you bring it in, it's right there, right? Shoulder pocket. You want to bring your cheek to the butt, not butt to the cheek, cheek to the butt. Most importantly, take it off safety, put it on fire, which it already was. But. Safe. Mag out. Take a deep breath. Just relax. Pull it in. Elbows down, shoulders in. Earlier, I was joking off the B-roll. Violence is not cool. I don't like what I'm seeing out there. So I definitely don't condone or support it. I wouldn't say necessarily not support it because I do indulge in the music that advocates for it. But it's just music. 
I'm really passionate about that. So this is not gang member stuff. This is stress stuff. This is good for stress. You feel me? It's good for stress. So we gonna see if I can drill a hole in that paper. Bag dumping now. Why not? Ammunition is expensive. I did just waste sixty dollars. It's cool though. Get the fuck on the ground right now, nigger. Fresh. So, our next activity for the day is my personal favorite. Actually. I like to be a know-it-all because I know a lot of things. Certain things I'm not even sure how I know. I just know it, and that's because I read a lot. So I feel like one of the most important things that you can have is knowledge if not the most important thing because without knowledge you're probably stuck and you can't do anything so i'm about to show you all what we're about to get into excuse me sir what are you doing today oh it's funny that you asked that um actually at a museum right now you know i feel like education is really important and I, I'm an educational person. So, are you are you doing anything right now? No. So, if I want to do this for the kids today, why not visit a museum? It's like a, a video for all my audiences in one. I'm not exactly sure if kids actually be watching me, but I mean, I'm pretty sure when they actually do start watching me, something up there for them, right? I actually should have brought my daughter. Nice, you know, get that up there. Get that up there. Holy shit. Where she went at? Oh, there she go. Free, free my dog Dory, man. Free that's my dog. Not her. That's not her? That's not Dory? No. Bro, they look like the same fish. <laughs> no. Oh, my fault, fam. You ain't you ain't the person I'm looking for. You ain't. Do you do you do you know where Nemo at though? No? Alright. Guys, this is a puffer fish in case you've never seen a puffer fish before. That is yeah. a puffer fish. That boy's sucking the hell out of that glass. You a freak, ain't it? Oh, you a freak. Yeah, you high and you don't want to get ate, huh, nigga? Do a good job camouflaging, but all I did was walk over. And look at this nigga chilling in the corner. Hey, stop when I said, we should, holy shit. Look at them motherfuckers. Get down on them. I know y'all ain't fucking. Well, that's probably more than Oh, y'all some freaks, ain't it? Oh, shit. Them boys over there chilling. It's the fake books, man. It got weird really fast i don't i don't know why i mean, did you guys know fucking seahorses the guys have babies did you know that yes that's a weird thing to fucking know why do you know that that's, that's strange what is Shit. Recycle.
like, don't get too bad. Our planet is already dying. Make sure you recycle. Oh, what the hell? Uh, seals. Mm, not, oh, Those they're are babies. Seals. They're babies, bro. And they're playing. Zoom in on them. They're playing. Yeah, education. Guys, be nice to your siblings. Is he okay? Kids. Kids, you gotta remember. You're a human being, bro. This is a real educational moment for the adults. Them son of a bitches, they don't play. They want money. But I'm gonna hand it for y'all. You better find a manager. Smokers? That boy blow. Oh, huh? Shit right there. Spoon. Apollo, I'm going to be reporting you the daily weather for today. You know, and it's funny that I should mention that. You know, a lot of times I think in school that we didn't learn anything, but we actually learned a lot. Because I never thought I would have been using slower for y equal mx plus b. But I actually be using y equal mx plus b to find a slope of the line people have crossed when they come up. So, your currents, you know a lot about those. You fall in that, you will end up in somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe fucking China. Who the hell is this guy? I don't want him because I'm a new one. Snow, Well, that's not innovative at all. Why would you have this guy on every single last one? I did not find the FPL employee, but I do have some information on how to survive a storm. So, step one in surviving a storm is you won't. A hard storm, you will not survive. Your chances are not that high. So, I guess I'm going to be speaking for the people that will have a chance. Follow me. Before the storm, if you wait until the day before a hurricane strikes, you might find yourself out of life. Black people never have these problems because we are prepared for everything. Literally, through the last storm, they were buying all the milk. What the hell are you gonna do with a cart full of milk? I don't know. <laughs> everything, the water, the tissue, even the fucking saltine crackers. I, I don't know what they're gonna do with that, but even the fucking saltine crackers. It's crazy. You should see how crazy people are. Black people are really, really crazy. And I just think that is so interesting. Like, they literally lose their mind for Popeye's chicken sandwiches. And then I finally get the chicken sandwiches, and it wasn't that good. Dope Pitcher. Pitcher. Dope, bro. This is Black Ops 1, go to game. That's the Wonder Weapon. You know, I usually don't do this, but I'm for flexing purposes, you know, motivational type shit. This is my ride right here. You might get my gears. So, how you drive this bit? I don't know. Uh, this is weird. Why would they put the button like then? Because then you gotta cuff it like this. Oh, up there and they're about to crash. Can't go faster. I'm gonna crash this motherfucker. Crash. Crash this shit. Oh, wow. That was a waste of my time.
9-11? You see how this looks like a bunch of bullshit? This is the right bullshit. Man, hell no. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It's meant to be positive and inspiring. And I do repeat, I'm upset that I lost my ticket. Because I hardly buy anything for myself. So when I do buy something for myself, I'm always taking care of the people. I try to take care of what I bought myself. So losing that really upset me. And I did not want to do the video anymore. But let this be a lesson. No matter what's going on, no matter what you got going on in life, achieve your goals, grab for your goals, because life won't throw obstacles in your way. And it's on you to jump over those obstacles. it was a telescope built by a curious species for taking pictures of the universe but they couldn't know that it took 10,000 people from 14 countries this is a telescope to help us understand Milky Way a spiral of 200 billion stars so big it takes light a hundred thousand years to cross it until now, the most powerful space telescope was 13.8 billion years ago. This was the beginning of time and space. Slowly, under the force of gravity, tendrils of material began to coalesce and the first stars and galaxies shone forth. We've never seen them, but they must be there this new telescope is to look for those first things the only planets we knew existed were the ones in our own solar system humanity's last view of the telescope as it moves to its workplace about a million miles away from Earth. The reveal of the first science images from the James Webb Space Telescope. It was all this. So the first image is a deep field. We now have this new telescope that's opened up our eyes to see something that we couldn't see before. I once was the telescope has shown us how stars are born, and it also shows us how they die. And JWST found this star on the brink of a more dramatic end. It will soon go supernova, exploding in a fireball that can outshine the entire galaxy. And our Earth, and us too, were born out of exploding stars like... So, as you guys see, the documentary about them building the world's largest and apparently most expensive telescope. It cost ten million dollars to get across the world for wherever they got it. Who knows how much it actually costs to actually build? And with that right there, lets me know they can choose to end world hunger whenever they want. They just don't want to, because I never understand the concept of too much money means it loses its value. How the fuck print it? Rip that shit. It doesn't lose its value. As long as I got, as long as I need money to get me something to eat, it ain't never lose its value. What the hell? Learn something new, man. With a thought like that, one lady was crying, and I understand because the universe is a beautiful thing, the world is a beautiful thing, and I just think it's so crazy that we got so much chaos and calamity out here, and things like this exist. But I also do know that in the places where a lot of chaos and calamity are born from, people do not know things like this exist. They don't know, or 
their reality is shielding them from actually enjoying the essence of life. The essence of life is a beautiful thing. Now, I can't necessarily merch that the images that I just showed y'all are real, but I can merch that the possibility is a thing. Maybe. I believe it. I don't know. You let me know. But that's today's video. Something cool for everybody. I hope everybody enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Most importantly, share. Even if it's not something that you found interesting, somebody else should probably find it interesting. You ain't never pinch nobody You ain't never been on the drill Sit outside till the sun come up Cause you ain't seen nobody You ain't never seen a nigga head Lean over to the side Cause you just got hit in this noggin Fuck niggas stop all the nuns